Introduction to Lab 18, Digital Communication. In this video, we will discuss how a variety of concepts and skills developed in the Digital Electronics Lab series will be combined to design and build a digital communication device. A communication device is able to send and receive messages by methods of digital communication. Serial communication sends individual bits through a single communication channel one at a time, creating a long stream of data. It is more common for long-distance transmission due to its low cost and faster transmission speed. In contrast, parallel communication sends each bit of a single stream of data through its own channel, creating more than one stream of data. It is more expensive since it requires more material, but used for short-distance transmissions such as RAM. Encryption is a method of security that manipulates a digital message to prevent those without a decryption key from reading it. The correct decryption key will manipulate the message in such a way that will return it to the original message. You will also get the chance to work with the NI Elvis MX function generator to generate a clock pulse that replaces the system clock built in the DSDB board. Both hardware and software aspects are going to be discussed. In this lab, you will build a communication device that generates, sends, receives, and displays serial 8-bit messages. The messages will be input with switches and displayed with eight LEDs on the DSDB board. The communication can be between two DSDB boards or on the same board. Additionally, you will be given the opportunity to add a level of security to your messages using encryption and decryption. Communicate simple words by using a character encoding scheme. Communicate between two boards and transmit numbers using seven-segment displays. You will need to brainstorm and design the circuits needed for these extensions on your own with the guiding instructions provided. In this lab, you will use D flip flops, counters, NAND gates, and combinational logic circuits. This lab will combine concepts you have acquired in previous labs and allow you to demonstrate your skills more independently.